Today I'm going to be reading Piers for Pterodactyl. The worst alphabet or book ever. All the letters that misbehave and make words nearly impossible to pronounce. Piers for Pterodactyl. So it's it's trying to make silent letters. Like P is for pterodactyl and because pterodactyl starts with P, but the P is silent. Did you know that there are some really wacky words that start with a silent letter? Most of them you can just ignore that pesky first letter and sound out the rest of the word. But be careful, there are other words in this book that don't follow the rules. Look to the back of the book for some help with some of the mis mischievous words. A is for aisle. As in like aisle in a grocery store. The bread aisle has not be cl been cleaned in eons. And nine tiny beasts meet to have a feast. B is for delium. We doubt anyone knows what delium is, but it's the only word dumb enough to begin with a silent B. C is for czar. Shh. The fascinating czar is secretly part Czech. D is for Djibouti. The boat race begins when the handsome judge from Djibouti drops his handkerchief from the br bridge. E is for you. Not for you. You as in a group of sheep, I think. Let's see what... I think it's a group of sheep. Is that that or a female sheep? A female sheep. Aline the ewe was so euphoric, the wolves were eaten, she, she, gave, she even gave the eulogy. F is not for photo, phlegm, fill your phone. F is only for photo when you speak fluent Spanish at home. G is for Noki. The gnomeo's waiter, there's a bright white gnat nibbling on my Noki. H is for air. The honest air admits that the herbalism isn't in his cup of tea. I is not for I. We asked the pirate if he has two eyes and he said I I. J is for I high I I think. That's it. I just tried to go through the pronunciations. High lie. J is for highlight. I do not try to pronounce these words in this sentence. K is for knight. The noble knight's knife nicked the na knave's knee. L is not for L. An elephant named L rode the L train halfway to El Paso and dined on hearts of palm... Dined on hearts of palm with her folks. M is for mnemonic. But now Mr. M can't remember why. N is not for knot. As in the knot that you do with your shoelaces. N is for naughty children who will, s who will sing a solemn hymn when autumn comes to an end. O is for Yuji. Ouija, I mean. The French leopard says, Oi, would love to play Ouija with the wee witch from Waxer. P is for pterodactyl. I will not try to pronounce some of these words. Q is for quinoa. We can enjoy quinoa and quiche by the keys of Qatar. R is not for R. In England, the the Queen proclaims we aren't saying the R's in butterfly, shark, or lizard. S is for seas. C C swam through the debris in the seas to see the imaginary Isle of New New Arkansas. T is for tsunami. 
see that extra teaser. The Charging Tsunami washed away all of Takovi's Chotkites. Chotkis. I do not know how to pronounce that. You is not for you, as in you. You could never have guessed that the wolf was disguised as the you. V is for five. W is for Wren. The Wren wrapped the rabbit's gift in red but forgot to write a note. X is for Xylophone. Xavier's extra arm made him an exceptional Xylophone player. Y is not for Y. The wives who... Yives... Wives... I do not know. Who is wearing yellow shorts yells, Why is the Eiffel Tower upside down? And Z is for, let's just check the pronunciation, Javago. Good night, Javago the Zebra. I've enjoyed our rendezvous. Rendezvous. You can see, even I was having trouble pronoun pronouncing pronouncing some of the uh, words in this book so it's all the letters that misbehave and you can see the T4 tsunami thing there